guys, welcome to On Fire Roblox Scripting, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a fading GUI part 2 updated, and this version is very easy for you guys to modify and follow. So before we start, make sure that you have Explore and Properties open there under the View tab, and let's just get right into it. So the first thing we need to do is go into the Start GUI, click the plus, and enter in a Screen GUI. After that, go into the screen GUI, click the plus, and enter in a frame. So this will be the frame that will cover up the whole screen. So like, so when your fade happens, you know, your whole screen's covered. So we can go into the properties, and then what you want to do is just make sure that it was at its original position. So that would be the top left right there, or the just set the position to zero comma zero comma zero comma zero like that. Under the size, you just want to write 1, 0, 1.1, 1 .1, 0. After that, that should fill out the whole screen and a little bit extra. So just drag it up until the bottom of it just perfectly fits there. That way, it will also cover some of the top parts of the whole screen. So it should look like something like this. And after that, most fades are black. So we're just going to make ours black. And then that's all we have to do for the frame. After that, we want to go into the frame, click the plus, and enter in a local script. I've zoomed it in so you guys can follow very easily, so just write what I write. So local frame equals to script.parent, go down two lines, and then wait. So this will be how long we wait before the, um, you know, the fade starts. So go down two lines, and then write for i equals to 1 comma 100 do, go down line, and frame dot background transparency plus equals to 0 0.01 go down line and write wait 0 0.01 so basically what we have done here is every 0 0.01 seconds for 100 times the background transparency will get added by one which means that this thing will slowly fade away now why is this easy for you guys to modify it's because of this number right here so right now it would take one whole second for the fade to complete but if you just simply change the number into two that's two seconds three and this would be like 10 seconds so very easy for you guys to modify um you know if you guys want different times but yeah that's literally the whole script very easy and let's just go test it out so i just loaded in and we'll just wait for a bit because we have 10 seconds on the script right here so you can see here, just gotta wait a bit more. And there we go, the fade took, should be one second. So the fade took one second for the fade to completely fade out. And uh, yeah, after that, basically the fade is done. Um, and then like maybe you can start your game. But anyways, that'll be it for this tutorial. If you liked it, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And since I don't wanna make another video for the extras channel, I'm just gonna add that video right behind this one. Enjoy. Hey guys, welcome to On Fire Roblox Scripting, and this is the extras video for how to make a fading GUI version 2, which you know, the script is much more better and much more easier to modify. So basically what I'm going to do first of all is make the fade into 5 seconds, because why not? But in this extras video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the fade initiate after like, like a loading screen or something. So the first thing we need is the actual loading screen. So I'm just gonna copy and paste that loading the the frame we have right now, and I'm just gonna rename the frame into loading. After that, we can go there, and then we'll go click the plus, enter in a text label. Make sure to drag up because the text label would be up there since we made the GUI a bit up to cover the whole screen. Just make sure you drag it back down, and then we'll just drag the text label in the middle. I'm just gonna call this text loading. And then we can go into the properties of it and then i'm just gonna make the background say green and then in the text i'm just gonna say load and i'm gonna make a text scaled and i'm gonna make it bold and i'm also just gonna change the background of the uh, loading into yeah cyan uh, if you guys haven't watched the uh, loading screen video version 2 i'd highly recommend you guys watch that So right now we have the loading screen, we just need to do one more thing, is go back to the first, um, you know, first script. And here we're just going to go down the line, local load equals to script.parent.parent.loading. 
and then after that we will write wait 10 seconds and then we'll go down two lines and write load not that load dot visible equals to false uh, not whatever that is uh, visible equals to false and then after that we can go down two lines and write wait five seconds so basically what we have done here is after the load the loading is done loading basically uh, we'll wait 10 seconds for the loading to finish loading after five seconds the five second fade will start and yeah let's just go test it out so I just load in and you can see that that's the loading screen and then after 10 seconds the loading screen should be gone just like that and after five seconds the five second fade should start and there we go the fade should take five seconds and yeah so that'll be it for this tutorial if you liked it make sure to like comment subscribe and share and uh yeah bye